Good morning, you guys. Happy New Week. Hoping your week is great so far. Hoping you've had a good weekend so far. I'm saying weekend because today is on a Sunday and it's around 10.30. I've woken up at 10. Or did I wake up at 10.30? What time is it? I don't know. It's around 10.30 to 11. So I've woken, I've woken up a bit late today because um, I had a long night. I think I slept at 3. So... It was a struggle waking up and I already feel like um, I need another 10 hours of sleep. I don't know why. But I quickly grabbed a shower to at least be able to wake up because I can already feel that my energy is just everywhere today. And I hate that because I have a video to film for you guys today. So I need a cup of coffee, some soft fluffy pancakes, you know, to be able to get my day started. So... I'm going to do that right now because that cup of coffee is going to do magic to me. Hopefully though, hopefully. So let's see how the day goes. Uh, pray for my energy because we need to shoot a video today. It's wash day. I'm washing my hair and I promised you guys to do my hair care routine and show you um, that kind of hairstyle that I do uh, that has been serving me during this uh, quarantine moment. So I'll be sharing that with you in a bit. I hear my voice. I think you can even tell I just woke up. So I'll be back with a more softer tone to be able to talk to you guys. So stay tuned. You guys, see what I found? Pancakes. I'm so, so happy. I'm not going to lie and say I cooked this because I didn't. My partner did and I'm just so happy. I just came in and found ah, so many pancakes. I'm so happy now. A cup of coffee and enjoy our pancakes. So you guys, I'm supposed to be doing my hair, but instead, I'm here listening to Abel Motua, but I do think he's such a good story storyteller. I've been enjoying uh, his story series that he has been doing. So I do think uh, 20 more minutes to go. Yeah, around 20 more minutes to go, and then uh, then we can wash my hair, but I'm really enjoying this. Yes, it's ready for wash day. Me. So uh, last night, not last night, I think yesterday afternoon, I pre-put my hair. That is just a bit of uh, water and some mafuta. I used avocado oil. Uh, I also used coconut oil, but I wanted to try something different. I'm also in the process of trying different products for my hair to see how my hair reacts and to see like what are the best, best products for my hair. So I used avocado oil. It's soft enough, so I can actually wash it. Now, I also want to show you uh, some of the products that I use uh, for my hair. No, I'm trying new products, actually. I'm trying new products. I will show you the new products that I'm using. And uh, we can have this washed. So, yeah. Can you see, guys, how soft it actually looks? I think I have to comb through so that you guys can see that it doesn't have any knots. The pre poo process is just a must for me. It's a must. But I think you can see it's a must. There are no knots at all. So when I wash it, it will be a very easy process. Anyway, let me show you the products that I will be using. So I want to try new products uh, on my hair. So I got new products from Naturally Glammed. I'm going to link them down below if you are in search of new products to also try out. So I got... Um, Leave moisturizer and a conditioner in rosemary and mint. So, yeah. Then, uh -huh. we have the deep conditioning treatment also in rosemary and mint. Um, then, we have their butter, the four-in-one hair butter also in rosemary and mint. Then, we have their air growth oil also in rosemary and mint then uh now with that uh to wash my hair i want to use this saru 
product i've never used seru uh shampoo before this is my first time using i've never used seru um products before this is my first time trying them out i've been using the bouquet bar soap the shampoo and that's what i've been using so i want to try this out i'm in the process of actually trying new things uh on my hair to just see how my hair reacts then i use this dark and lovely um detangler to detangle my hair if i feel the need to so these are the products that i'll be using for now it's shampoo time yeah oh also forgot to mention for this product and uh this other one you can find them at super cosmetics also the bouquet bar soap that i was using you can find them at super cosmetics so for these naturally glammed um products i'll link them down below they do deliveries so the product will be delivered to you at your doorstep so yeah so to begin with i'll be using the shampoo this saru shampoo and then um i'll be using the dark and lovely detangler just in case i need it if i feel like i have some knots in the in the hair then that's the time i'm going to use this detangling product and yeah so i'll see you after these two products i don't understand um okay i have to set you the lighting is okay the lighting is not that good but um i don't understand why i woke up in the morning and took a complete shower because it's like i had another shower right now so that was a complete waste of water and electricity but anyways um so washed my hair Ooh, the shrinkage is real so i don't know how many times uh you guys shampoo your hair but i do it two times so i do it the first time rinse it off go in um with the shampoo again rinse it off and then i use the detangling product um and then after that now i want to use the deep conditioning treatment i want to use um this product uh on my hair and by the way guys this is not like a tutorial on how to do your hair i'm not a hair guru so no it's not it's not a tutorial that you can refer to it's more of you know my way of doing uh, my hair at the end of the day i'm also trying new products and learning to understand my hair so yeah One thing I really love is when you use a deep conditioner and it just melts your hair and it becomes so soft. So I do think this product is actually reacting so good uh, to my hair. So I'll be using this um, cling film to wrap around my hair to just trap in a bit of heat. And then I will let it sit for one hour and rinse it off so yeah now i'm going to put on a shower cap and then if we get so one hour to trap in a bit of it and then i'll be back so in between i've decided to make some lunch and i'm making pilau so in with the onion then i'm going to add in some garlic and ginger also have some dania stems because i'm using dania to make kachumbari so I don't want my dania stems to go to it. So I'm just going to throw those in there. And
hours later. Now, uh, as my food cooks, I think we can uh, we can wash, we can rinse off the conditioner. I just want to see if my hair is soft enough. Now that was my third shower today uh, but now i'm told between having lunch first or styling my hair which is not even lunch it's like late lunch lunch plus dinner i don't know what to do first do i film first or do i eat first okay i think i can sit down and show you a part of uh, my hair because i'm not gonna style everything on camera so i'm going to do a bit of it so that you can see like how i do the knots and then I'll go have my lunch and then I'll start the rest later. So yeah, let's let's do that. I think that's fair. So for the styling part, I have this um, live-in moisturizer stroke conditioner that I'll be using. So um, I use the LOC method. Then I have uh, some avocado oil that I'm going to be mixing with this. Uh, air growth oil from naturally glammed so i'll be mixing a bit of it uh, in a container and that's what i'll be using after using the this moisturizer then uh for the cream that i'm using i'm using this uh saru mm. i'm using this saru shea and avocado butter curls pudding so it's what i'll be using uh to to style yeah so i don't like doing big knots i prefer having a smaller ones because i want them to be decent then uh after this i'm going to use the living moisturizer just a bit of that so work that in and then i go in with my mafuta now which i've not mixed yet i need to mix that so i'm going to use this khalid to pour in some avocado oil I've, I've just realized I have some extra avocado oil that's so just a bit of that so and then we have this air growth oil that I'm going to mix with the avocado oil and then um, so just a bit of it and run that through the hair struts and then we go in with the cream the saru uh, cream this is what helps with the curls so just a bit of that Now with the knots, because I know this is uh, where most of you are interested to know, what I do is I divide it into half and then I will do something like a twist. So half and then I will do something like a twist. So just coil it like a twist. Don't mind about the cream, it dries uh, down. So I took on the two white things. Don't worry about that. It's going to completely dry. Then make sure you get up to the this car part. Doing a hair tutorial is hard. <laughs> but I hope I'm making sense and you're getting um, the idea of how to do these things. And then now what I do is I try to like tuck it in but again it's more of the coiling part so what i do is you just turn it you just form a knot so i think i should have practiced um this before doing the video but never mind i think you guys get it Hey 
everybody it's on a monday the following day so i finished up my hair i wanted to show you the final look so i think you have been seeing a lot of these uh on my vlog so it's not a new look but uh this is going to keep me for like an entire week and then when i do the knots it's going to have that curly finish so yeah that's the trick now i want to close the video but before that i have received a package from prince k yes prince k i'm going to uh leave their description okay jesus i'm going to leave their link in the description box below they sell prints i want to unbox it with you just in case you're looking for new prints to add in your space then maybe you can consider them so let me do that i just realized i can actually close the video and then leave a small clip of me unboxing the print so yeah thank you so much guys for watching thank you for being here i love 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 you so much i appreciate you for always finding time to check out my videos and uh subscribe if you haven't subscribed we're getting to 10k that's where we are going so subscribe if you haven't subscribed if you have enjoyed the video give it a thumbs up and i see you guys uh, in my next video on friday so 